it's Bonnie. I am back with my first ever Bath & Body Works perfume that I want to show you. Oh my gosh. So I bought this for Mother's Day for my mom because she really likes perfume. And I want to start collecting these and I kind of wanted to see what they were like if it's worth buying. And I think probably the best way to buy these is to kind of go all in and do buy three, get three with the 20% off coupon. That's going to be the least expensive way to buy them because even though they're $39.50, it's like 40 bucks. If you were to buy three of them, that would come to $120, but then you'd get three free, so they're like $20 each. Then if you had a 20% off coupon, it would bring them down to $16 each, which is actually not a bad deal for a perfume. So they come in these like really pretty boxes, a little writing on there, and then currently, um, wait, first let me grab one of these. Um, let me say I do use these a lot. I also collect the perfume, um, the sprays, the mini sprays. I love these. Oh my gosh. Oh, there goes Coco. You know that was coming. <laughs> Chuck Driver just went by. Um, and they also have a men's cologne. The new coast looks interesting. Coco. But anyway, Coco. Come here. Come on. She hears that truck. <laughs> so anyway, poor Coco. Um, currently in the perfume, they have Perfect Peony, they have Into the Night, they have Japanese Cherry Blossom, which no one likes. <laughs> My mom likes it. They have Saltwater Breeze, they have Gingham, and okay, that's it. In the actual large um, perfume. So you take this out and it's this tiny little thing. It's a big box and a tiny perfume. I like the box though. I think I'm keeping the box. And then the perfume actually is absolutely gorgeous. I love the bottle. Check this out how pretty this is. Oh my goodness. So it's like a really like high quality um, like square bottle. Looks kind of like a ice cube, diamondy ice cube. And on the back there's a flower that shines through so you can see it either on the back or you can see it through the front and it has like a metallic metal top. And then so you can take the top off and a little sprayer going on here. How many ounces are these? This is 1.7 fluid ounces. So obviously this is going to be a lot stronger than like a fine fragrance mist because it is a perfume. It does have a lot um, longer staying power. Oh my gosh, this smells, you know me, I don't even like florals and I love this one. Oh my gosh, this one smells so good. My mother's going to have to fight me for this. I might just keep it <laughs> to buy her another one. Um, it says this is an airy blend of peony, natural apple oil, and vanilla sandalwood. It's funny, I'm surprised it only got 4.3 stars. Actually, you know, it's funny. A one star just wrecks everything. Most people like this one on Bath & Body Works. Then there was like one person or two people said it smells like antiseptic, horrible, nauseating, dizzy. No, I don't get that at all. This smells beautiful. Really, really nice. Um, and like I said, you're going to get the staying powder with the perfume. In the past, I haven't really bought the perfumes before because I have so many of the fine fragrance mist and I just reapply. I mean, I'm never out like for eight, nine hours where I wouldn't have to reapply. Is this a sticker on here? No, it's like a, like an applique. Um, so perfume was never high on my priority, but you know me, I love to collect Bath and Body Works and I, I just feel like this would be a fun thing um, to collect. So depending on um, if I get more coupons or what goes on with these, I may pick a few more of these up just because they're so pretty and I'm, I'm kind of really liking the box here. <laughs> I can't decide if I want to keep this out like just on my dresser or, you know, maybe, you know, put it up like in a box. I, I am going to give this back to my mother. I'm going to be good. <laughs> she likes it too. But if I decide to get another one, um, I think maybe I'm trying to decide which one I would want next. Um, it's funny because I actually think that Into the Night would be a good perfume. I go back and forth on Into the Night. Um, that's the one that is the alluring blend of dark berries, midnight jasmine, and rich amber. I feel like Into the Night is more of a fall scent though. Um, number two on my list is I think I need to get a gingham just because it's a neat collectible for the Bath and Body Works brand and I want to have a gingham um, in my collection. So 
let me know your thoughts on the perfume if you buy these. They actually had Daydream too. I'm actually, it's funny, that's what kind of what turned me on to the perfume. I wish I had bought the Daydream. And if it comes back or I see it in the store, maybe they'll do it for semi-annual. I think I would definitely pick up the Daydream because the bottle is so beautiful. So there we go, the perfume. Loving this one so much. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.